Look, right now you are coming into a bunch of manifestations. So you need to keep your mind on the prize. This is what it's like. It may appear to where things are stagnant, but it always happens like that. So it's up to you in order to not stagnate your own blessings that's here right now for you. Keep your mind focused on like non-thinking. You see, when you're in a thought form, you're manifesting your thoughts. So if you're thinking about things that does not serve you, you're going to manifest those thoughts. And uh, really like touch bases, we're not so much a reflection of each other because we each existed and we've uh, operated on different paralines. So think of it like this. Each of us come from different star systems in the galaxy. So we each, that's why we each have a zodiac sign because we come from the planet to wherever our zodiac sign you know associates us with so if you're a leo you come from the leo constellation if you're a virgo you come from the virgo constellation and so forth right so this is why you are the embodiment of your ast astrology your zodiac because that's where the planet the star system that you come from so we're not ref we're not necessarily a reflection of each other because the thing is we come from christ consciousness yes Everything was created from Christ conscious, even the humans that was created by Yakub, right? Because you got to understand everything, every particle, but each thing have their different purpose. So that's why some people are only embodying this enlightenment. Not everybody. If it was, if everybody was a reflection of everybody, we will all be operating on the same subplane. So we will be all existing and we will all be aware of the same thing. So technically, you know, facts, data, and statistics, that's what I go by. So basically what I'm saying with that is that if you are drawn to this or if you find this or you resonate with this then then you are a reflection or if you're on the, you come from the same star system because you choose to operate on this vibratory because you understand that's why action is the most action is you telling the universe aka christ consciousness that you understand that you agree that you are aware because we can think something or we can or we can learn something but unless you apply it then you start to vibrate in whatever you're applying so no we're not a reflect everyone's not a reflection of each other that's why some people we're all different speak we're all different stuff let's just leave it at that all right i'm not gonna say say too much into that but so yes um so make sure you understand you that's why you have a different purpose here when you come to this planet because you are your own individual nobody's like you that's why two people isn't the same if you notice friends that you had since you was a child you can't it's harder to come across those friends now right because those ones are rare. They're not every day, every motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? That's what it is. I've learned this from, you know, I've I've learned this from, from um team after um team. I know, right? So basically, everyone has its own indistinct individuality, but yet everyone still comes from Christ conscious. Even the fallen angels. I know, right? So but but you wouldn't call fallen angels God's children, would you? No, you would not. So you know what I'm saying? You have to understand the separation between that because as long as you're not aware, you won't be able to grasp what it fully means, all right? So don't let anyone attach themselves to you because then they can take what you have. And you don't want people to take what you have because people have been doing that much too long and now I feel like it's time to take back what they took from you, which is what's going on. Karma is actually operating in effect right now because things was taken and now it has to be given back the planet the food the sources the energy the information you notice how things are coming out now right because it has to be given back that's why everything is quote unquote oh man 11 years and there's there's nine more you notice how it's right now it wasn't like that before when you weren't benefiting when you weren't awakening but it's like that right now all of a sudden notice the coincidences in time there are no coincidences. Everything is planned out for a reason. This was not a relevant a relevancy before, right? The things going on, the things that's like being being pushed out in the world right now, right? It wasn't, you know, there wasn't negative things. It wasn't people focusing on things. It was giving billions and trillions to other motherfuckers since forever. This is just the time you guys are aware about it, right? So think about it. But now all of a sudden, what what is the problem? Why is it? Why is such a big deal now? Niggas been snapping each other forever. Why is it a big deal now? Think of it. Because you're coming into your knowing. That's the only thing that's different now. It's only when you're coming into your knowing, it's a big deal. But all of a sudden, 
it wasn't a big deal before. So notice how people are coming out the woodworks and giving you information now. I know, but they wasn't trying to give you any information before. AKA, so you can kind of put two and two together yourself. If you can't, then, hey man, you might just go get you a, a gulp and a soda pop, a hot dog from the 7-Eleven and enjoy yourself. Cause it's not meant for you. And that's, in the, and that's okay. That's what I mean. Whoever this is not meant for, you think that's a reflection of you? No. You get me? All right? It just shows, society shows that no one's a reflection of each other because look at what goes on. Does that sound like each is a reflection of each other? Would people treat their reflection like shark? Would people try to do stuff to their reflection knowingly? You got to get me right? So it, it just, everything adds up. You don't have to put too much thought into it. I like to non use less thought as possible. Because the less thought you use, the more accurate the answer is. Alright? So I'm going to make this video short. I ain't going to make it too long, bro. I'm going to do another video on this. But hey, bro, I could go all day with this shit, bro. It's easy to me. You feel me? This is fun. You know what I'm saying? Because I used to give this nigga information for free. I'd be giving information, you know, you know what I'm saying? And it wasn't computing. And it was making niggas look at me like the enemy. I know this now. I know, right? Trying to help motherfuckers and they look at you like the enemy. Notice how that shit work. Alright? All right, peace.